Hey, you just saw it. We're pressing our way to the Saturday Night Special where it will be the career of the line on the cage as Muhammad Ali Baez and Michael Hayes do it one more time. This contest is set for one fall. Introducing first from Buffalo, New York, weighing in tonight at 213 pounds, Jamin Olivencia. Of course, alongside the star maker Kenny Bolin, Dean Hill still enjoying his vacation. And tonight, Kenny, so much action on the card. New television champion in action, Christopher Silvio. Ladies title being defended. And right now, we start with a fifth generation superstar, King. 5G himself is there. I understand the 5G. His opponent from Richmond, Virginia, weighing in at 169 pounds, the world's first and only fifth generation wrestler, Rafael Constantine. that sit-down interview that I had with Muhammad Ali Baez following the three-part interview that I had with Michael Hayes in this hour tonight. But right now we start with high-impact action. I call him Jamin Olivencia. I call him Mr. 200%. He knows no quit. He is always going a million miles an hour. And that is my number one criticism about him is that he goes way too fast. He expends way too much energy even before he grabs his first headlock or leg scissors or whatever the case may be. I know he's got all that energy, but save it for the match. You never know how long the match is going to be. It might be two minutes. It might be 22. It might be an iron two minutes. You don't know. Jamin Look Olivencia. at him. Look at him. He goes that way from the time he comes to the curtain till the time the bell rings and they haul him out of here. Of course, Olivencia known for being a high octane, high offense, innovative offense competitor. But here he's coming off uh, a loss last week, thanks to the newest, latest hired hands of Christian Muscagney. It was Jamin Olivenci and Jason Wayne getting cheated out of a win against Jesse Goddard and Marcus Anthony. Well, right now Olivenci laying those chops into a, um, let's, uh, let's just go ahead and say it, not the biggest man in the company. And these two, man, it looks like there's a little history there. The way they're going at each other, they're laying them in. With authority With into the turnbuckle. Behind them. There's that innovative offense that we spoke of from Olivencia. The Tasmanian Devil. I think I gave him that nickname. That's about what he acts like. Going around. He, and remember, the Tasmanian Devil never ever caught Bugs Bunny. So that might not be the best strategy for him. I don't think he did anyway. What in the Sam hell is that? Looks like a modified like it DDT. Bad. It does look like it hurt. Holy mackerel. Here is your winner, Jamin Olivencia. Olivencia could have cracked the neck right there of Rafael Constantine. Five G's been on a bit of a losing streak here, Delbert. He rolls, he rolls. Jamin Olivencia to a win.